welcome back to Garden Fever. It's uh, April now in Utah, and it's, as you can see, you can still see my breath, it's still a little bit of cold. But I wanted to share with you, this is a good time to come out and pull your weeds. Now I do it a little untraditionally. I do it the hard way, actually, not untraditionally the hard way. I pull them up manually with a tool. Even though it's hard on your back, I recommend using a back brace because it aerates the soil and it, uh, it, it's better than using chemicals, I think. You know, so I think doing it the hard way, it kind of lifts up the soil. And I think those slight disturbances are good for the topsoil. But anyway, I wanted to show you today, those are all the dandelions. So why am I doing it now? It's because it's before they go to seed. So uh, March, April, and into May is a good time to hit the weeds because they're just barely starting to come up. So you can get them before they even get, get running. If you wait and they go to seed, you're more than likely just going to spread them around. So with that being said, um, just a tip. So one thing that you want to educate yourself on is identifying weeds when they're sprouting early in the spring because they're not fully bloomed so some of the common identifying marks on the weeds may not be there yet. So learn to identify them as they come up early such as uh, dandelions, uh, thistle, morning glory also known as bindweed plagues my yard. That one is a tough one to get rid of just to name a few.